raise money for the NSU Auto Nation Institute for Breast and Solid Tumor Cancer Research. It's the second annual Pink Tie Bash. Uh, our Koamisi is lending us his name and we have sponsors to support breast cancer tonight. And it's uh, October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Um, I teamed up with uh, Nova Southeastern University. Um, you know, Auto Nation is one of our, our sponsors, is our big sponsor for the, for the event. Um, basically what, what got me started was, um, you know, my grandmother, she has had breast cancer in the past. She's beat breast cancer twice. Um, and, you know, she's, she's still with us today, but, you know, that's, that's one, one of the reasons that, that I got into this and, and wanted to help with um, breast cancer. So, uh, you know, I started this event and uh, this is the second year. Breast cancer is a, a tremendous disease that affects over 200,000 women in the United States every year. And women of different ancestries get different types of breast cancer. We have excellent treatment, treatments for some, and we have much less to offer others. And one of our major goals is to be able to offer all women of all ancestries very efficacious treatment for breast cancer so we can affect cure. And another pillar of our new institute is to prevent breast cancers in the next generation. So we're getting smarter at using consumer products that have chemicals which are less harmful and we're going to try to prevent, in my daughter's generation, prevent breast cancers so that we have fewer to actually work on. Uh, we're here, this is uh, Cole Misi's second annual Peak Tie uh, Bash and you know just uh, giving back for breast cancer and breast cancer awareness. Uh, it's a great cause. Uh, I'm, I'm here because, you know, I was uh, directly affected by it from my family members and, you know, anytime I can give back to the community and give back to causes like this, you know, I will. You know, it was back in March of 2015 that Koamisi and his business manager, Kevin, contacted me to help them raise money for breast cancer in honor of Koa's grandmother. And I said yes, and who would know that two months later, I too would be diagnosed with breast cancer. So here we are, fast forward, and yes, I'm a survivor. So there we go. I, I have to say that during my journey, I had a friend of mine ask me a question. She asked me, what have you learned during this whole Cintra diagnosis? And without missing a beat, I said to her, I learned that one thing in life is what you do, and that is you show up. You show up for your family, you show up for your friends, you show up for your community, you show up. And that's what every one of you guys did here tonight, you showed up. Because there's a lot of other things you could be doing on a Wednesday night, but you're here, we're raising money, you gave us your time, you gave us your resources, and that really counts for something. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you.